Welcome back everyone <coughs> to us playing in Equestria War as a Changeling Lands. As you can see, the Lunar Empire is doing very well against Equestria as well as capitulating the Crystal Empire, but we've gone ahead and done our own harmony. While their ideas may be somewhat similar and them an inspiration to us, we must not feel too tied to the ponies. Changelings and ponies, while not necessarily enemies, are fundamentally different. We must forge our own path separate from Equestria. Which I'm glad this is separate, but we can't do that one yet. A letter to the foreign queen. We must send a letter. To the rightful heir to the Olenian throne, Velvet assuring the deer of our support of our claims. Which would be pretty good overall. Give them a little more harmony support, more political power, and then a harmonic Olenia. We must infiltrate the kingdom of the king's government in planning ideas of harmonic rule both in his government and populace. Olenia will be free of warmongers and corruption. So, overall, not bad. And we do have our soldiers still here, but oh, we got encircled. Well, hopefully, the question dies before we uh, do anything. Also, can we ever call her, guys? Oh, yeah, we can. Okay, there we go. Yay! Goodbye. Um, oh, Stalingrad's at war, too. Look at that. Nova Grifonia. Uh, I would send you... Can I send you vultures? You know what? Sorry, our Panzer Group Pan Pandinius. We've got some of our guys. Gotta go other places. Thank you. But we're doing all right here. We can study acquire blueprints. You know what? War nation's been landlocked for a long time. The recent acquisition dockyards and other shipbuilding facilities lost to gain us various blueprints and technical documents enough to kick our own navy. Might as well. Oh, we can get early templates. We could. We don't really need those though. We're okay. And we have an energy drink here. A ghost warhead. Sour watermelon. And that's some steam. So right now in this episode, we're gonna try to uh, improve our being. Improve our industry, improve our army, and then the questions of war. We can go to war with the Lunar Empire later on, which if we so choose to do so, which wouldn't be a bad idea necessarily. Nice. Creating intelligence agency two. Boom. So this way we can get this person here. An extra operative slot, yes please. So a harmonic Olenia, and then soul velvet. Queen Velvet returns Olenia with changing backing. Time for us to support our allies' claim and pressure the current Olenian regime to allow our rule. Pretty much. Uh, what else we got here? 10, 10. Uh, yeah, we'll go this one. Why not? Better artillery. And there you go. There you go. Let's get ready to rumble here. Mm, yeah, we'll go with you. Since you are a panzer leader. And we did increase the size of these tanks just a little bit. Where are you guys at? Go all over there. Uh, let's see what we do right here, maybe. I really want to avoid mountains and hills, but that's what we got for now. I would like to recover some too here. There you go. Should do okay here. Can you guys go right here? Nice job, guys. And don't let them move. They probably can pierce us though, unfortunately. Am I right? Well, no. Oh, I'm wrong. Thank God I'm wrong. But in the meantime, we will also need to uh, research modern tanks. For mo well, maybe not modern tanks, but medium tanks. That would be our next step. Because we still don't like commies here. Commies are no bueno. Hmm. They have divisions all around here. Uh -huh. Keep going that way, I guess. You know? So what else we got around here? I really don't want to send tanks into here, but we could. We really needed to. It's going to hurt us, though. Good. And these guys also have uh, a field hospital now, which is decent. I would like to throw more artillery on them. Can we afford that? We have 900. We should be able to. Infantry. There you go. Reeling from the decision of throwing on way more artillery, which actually saved us. Wait, do we throw on artillery? What do we. Oh, we threw on one more of these. Oops, my bad. I wasn't paying attention. That's alright. You know what? Oh, we need more combat. No wonder, though. My bad. Oh well. There you go. Help support him in the attack. There you go. Nice job, guys. So eventually we'll probably go to World Stalingrad because we don't like commies. Uh, Pharynx? Sure. Why not? Um, you can do that, maybe. Oh. Well, they definitely caught onto that plan, didn't they not? Survivability studies are also very good. Have machine guns? Yes, please. And we'll study that one. Why not? And their tanks are gone too. 
Look how much experience this Juno Azure lore has gotten. It's very good. And through here. Ah, oh, come on. Well, you're here to beat him up, I guess. What if you can go there too? Why not? Machine and Pistola? Very good. Uh, so ahead of time. Um, here. Better recon, I guess. Stay there. See what you can do. Uh, interception, very nice. I want one million, one civic going on at all times. I think that'd be pretty decent for us. Forty percent sure, and a milli as well, right there. I really wonder what we can do with the Deer Republic. That interests me quite a bit. And naval stuff, yes, please. Keep making our navy very good. Our Monica Lenia. And saw Velvet. Yes. Join Velvet. Olenia's embroiled in a civil war, and our ally needs help. Our force must be mobilized and deployed against the false rulers of Olenia. Uh, mercy war plans would be bad. We did it all of these last time, but how about renew militarism? Queen Chrysalis has been defeated, and all thanks to the soldiers that have fought for friendship. It's time to focus on bringing the changing militias from an emergency force to something professional that any changing could be proud to serve in. Why not? Sounds pretty good to me. Uh, you know what? I want you back down here. Can you go here? It's not optimal for supply and whatnot, but whatever. I think we could do here. Supplies really bad. We're really trying to extend ourselves here. And I'm trying to just try and help the forces of harmony here. I'm just trying to help them out. That's all. That's all we're doing. Am I gonna ask instructions? Good. Come over here and get dispersed. Great interception. Pretty good. Okay, the Skyfall. Uh, actually, I tried this off-screen. They did not want to trade with us, so... Let's improve our relationship first. I'll we'll try. Why not? There you go. Coming with Panzer Leader, which is good. Maybe an Organizer. And a Ranger as well. Oh, awesome. Hey, more tanks. Nice. Oh, actually, no, you don't want to do that. But that's fine, whatever, for now. Doesn't really matter. Flip and blah. Not bad. We could go to war with the Lunar Empire, too, if we really wanted to, but probably not. Oh, we're attacking and defending. Interesting combination. As long as we don't get encircled and whatnot, I'm, that's pretty much all I care about, really. Better field hospitals are nice. It is 10-10. Let's get some cannons. Cannons seem nice. Good. Get the next one as well. There you go. Oh. Heavy machine guns. It's a little ahead of time. Changing battalions. Let's go with this one. Strategic infiltration. That's nice. Federation of the Bear. Why don't we get down there if we move fast enough? Nice. Ooh. Hold it here real quick. Well, they're here. But then they're not. Ooh, hello. We might have to encircle a tank division, maybe. Yeah, I get down here. That make you move a little bit faster. And we are close to getting encircled ourselves. Not ideal. Down here. Good. Ah, it's all velvet. Join velvet. Oh, absolutely. Well, they cut these guys off majorly, which is pretty cool. But the kingdom, huh? Equestrian socialism, eh? 
Selling equipment to Stalingrad. Queen Velvet. Wait, who's leading this one? Cirola, huh? Civil War. I love how we can just make them go to Civil War and do anything here. Alright, so volunteers, three divisions now. Two tank divisions. Throw in an infantry division for good measure. And maybe should make some motorized, maybe? It's only 18 combos, which is okay, it's not great. Infiltrated companies. Forest, urban attack. Why not? They're soft, so we need some field hospitals too, probably. There you go. Gonna do that too. Gonna be the last one. Led by no commander. Any extra things here? No. We do have, though, some casts. It's pretty nice to use. Government successful schools are done. Very nice, very nice. Mountains, huh? Quite not ideal to fight in. Maybe save that division, perhaps, yes. You're here to just beat people up. That's the thing I love the most. Just beating people up. Did you get there before? Yes. And they're encircled. Nice job, guys. Nice job. Good luck. Don't die. And we'll see you in a little bit. Uh, Victor? Sure. Yeah, this group here, too. Is there someone here? Oh, Skyfall accepts, finally. News from the great city of Skyfall are offered. Has been accepted. New wealth. Uh, should flow in a big nation soon. Stonks. Yay. More consumer goods. We love it. Speeding tanks. Good job, guys. Capital's down there. Shouldn't be too bad to get to. We do our business here. Um, I don't see anybody here, so we're just going to move in. Shall we? Yeah. The fall of Griffin Stone, it is what it is. Get down here, maybe. Close this up just a little bit more. It's too large for my tastes. Okay, this is really radically too, way too large. There you go. Something small and tiny. So we like them, small and tiny. Alright, 10, 10, better engineers are nice. In here. Have encountered too much difficulty? Honestly, no. There you go. A circle, beat them up, you know, the normal stuff. Over here. Small, maybe in circle. Fast enough, yep. And there you go. Uh, Nova Grifoni is not looking good, good though. Ah. Nope, don't care. Join Velvet. And, well, industrialize the south, why not? Oh, in civil intervention. After pledging her support to Queen Velvet's cause, it's time to shine and bring back harmony to help Velvet take down jo Johan. Our forces stand ready and willing to help uh, Velvet reclaim her rightful place as a harmonious queen. We'll help Velvet bring harmony to Elenia. Honestly, we don't need to really help them out. I'm enjoying this, being just a volunteer. But okay. Well, we're going in. At least we can do something here now, finally. There you go. Have fun. Have fun with it. Just kill them all. And what are you? You are fighters. There you go. There you go. That's a little ahead of time still. Anti-air. I'm not sure this would really help out that much, but whatever. And what do we got? That's good to me. We shouldn't have too much of Navy, so we leave our guys doing that. Why not? And that would help us up. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, we need more guns. That makes sense. War bonds. Uh, you know what, sure, why not? We could probably use consumer goods, right? Yeah, one, two. Yeah, why not? Interrogation techniques? Commando training, nice. Hey, at least we're aboard, though. 
Political power, 0.77 is not great, but we took the, the VOP up front. There, take it all. Negative 5 still, uh, there you go. Uh, darn it, we can't even take the Navy. Yeah. Can we take the Navy? Oh, we can take the Navy, dang it. It's alright. Kingdom of Alenia, look at you. You're now brown. Congra congr congrats, Velvet Queen. Yeah, we didn't totally mess with you to do that. We could do the Alenian Pact. We should officially form an alliance with the Alenians. So we can further cooperation between our countries. Or we can just marry them. The other thing we'd get married in this campaign, but while well, relations with Alenia have been closer than any other, there's a way we could draw uh, relations ever closer, both between our nations uh, and our rulers. So, not bad. Not bad whatsoever. Very, very nice. Extraction. Honestly, we could use more extraction because we need more steel. I kind of like just sending volunteers. This is weird. I actually usually never like sending volunteers to other nations. But right now, I'm kind of enjoying it. Uh, let's send you. Victor, honestly, I prefer you. You will go right here. You will be under someone else. You. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's what we got to do for now. Nova Grifonia. You can send him back. We don't like commies, do we? No, we don't. Thorax division, there you are. Zero. Have fun. Catch you later. There you go. Good job, guys. Aquilians March Wars, we do want to go to War Loon and Empire too. So we do need to bring up our infantry to be as large as possible. Because this is going to be a gigantic war. Eventually. I'm trying to build it up. Have a big old fight with those guys over there. Uh, nice. Nice. So far, I'm really enjoying this. It's much more peaceful than I thought it would be. For now. Alright, so we're back. What are we doing here? Dish has the south. Let's get married. Yeah. Though I'll never say that in real life, but you know. Enlarged feeding mechanisms. I like them large. We definitely need more guns. We're working on casts. We need more. We just need more steel, man. We really do just need more steel. So let's extract even more if we possibly can. Or we do more stuff here. Enemy air support. We're not for a chance. Well, we're not even using Jaegers. Eh, resource efficiency gain. Why not? Sounds good to me. Would you look at that? Is it a division all alone? Oh, yes, please. Oh, completely out of supply? They're really fat and thick. That's a fat division. We like them fat, but depends on the day. As you can tell from my campaigns, I like a lot of things. Oh, hello. You wanted to go around us or something? I don't like that. I really don't. Oh, we're about to get encircled. Hopefully, we can just recall en uh, engineers, volunteers. It's not ideal. Oh no, you got encircled in the end. Oh no. Um, to help these guys out, let's go push up north here. I don't, I, we're still going to lose in the end no matter what, but that's right. It is what it is, whatever. You, know what you hold here? I want you to go this way. I'm going to take those tiles, just in case for supply issues. Just go, just go ahead. As long as you don't get caught, that's all that matters, right? I say that about a lot of things, I guess, you know. Hold. Nice. Better engineers are nice. Um, let's go with here. Better light tanks, engine upgrades. Uh, we're going to work on medium tanks a whole bunch. Toe bucka. Endless moon celebration. Oh boy. Oh boy. Indeed. Cool, and are we getting there? Uh, 
Keep him in place, maybe? Or you go this way around him. That could also work, too. Or just go in right now. Global geo ma geological ma mapping. Very nice. Another division destroyed, just because we can. What's good? What else we got here? Expand the keyhole mine. Or crystal mines. Might as well, right? Let's see. Naval stuff. I'm kind of impartial making more infrastructure so we can get more supplies or resources that way. What else we got? Mary the Queen, and then what? The Unthinkable Union. With the monarchs join in marriage, a strange and surprising idea has been put forth. The unification of changing in dear lands. Into a commonwealth of sorts where both nations can be stronger. We must propose this to develop it. Mm, let's see these guys alone. Let me go here. There you go. Nope, oh, never mind. Well, let's see if they attack us first. If not, that's okay. Can you do that? Yes. Can you pierce us? Yes, you can. Not good. So we definitely need some medium tanks then. Of course, then again, I guess we could just go this way, right, this way too. Hello. How's it going? Hello? Wait, why'd you go that way? There you go. And, ooh, another tank division, nice. There you go. Followed up with what? Do we have medium tanks, armor? We have basic medium tanks, we need improved. We have improved here. We're searching, yeah, we've got two days out, that's not bad. That's good. Of course, we aren't using planes, but still, whatever. Hey, motorized, there you go. Flight stuff, there you go. Federstadt. Azure Lore, nice. Become a Panzer leader, that's awesome. Ooh, Velvet Accept, look at that. Alright, so that's not looking good for us right now. And uh, we're getting married. Good. Velvet was wooed by the Thorax's boldness and agreed to marriage. Uh, the ceremony was uneventful, but still separated across the two nations with joy from the citizens. Older deer and changing act with suspicion, set in prior rivalry and hatred between the two nations, but those towns are over now. Till death do us part. Proposed unification. If not, we'll beat you until submission. Democracy together is non negotiable. Alright, let's take a look-see. Output production, breakthrough, reliability versus speed. Well, let's go with output production. Alright, so we gotta make this guy up. We got more than enough army speed for this. It's gonna be quite costly, probably. I always like getting more speed. Reliability is not bad, but speed is nice. Riveted armor, more armor. I like armor. I don't really care about cost. Diesel engine, I like speed. Medium tank turret, one pony turret. This hurts soft attack and hard attack, which I don't like. And this hurts speed. I don't like that. Oh, we can make a flamethrower. Oh, is that so usable? We might still be able to use that. Medium cannons. Two. Not one, but two basic uh, anti-aircraft guns. So anti-air, which we don't need. Honestly, I just have always used medium cannons. It doesn't really matter too much. Medium housers are, are okay. Medium cans are fine. Brew radios are nice. Uh, wet ammo storage for more reliability, just in case. Smoke launchers, armor, sloped armor costs a lot. Fuel capacity, you don't really know why we would need that. Um, we don't honestly have to choose another one, but defense, soft attack, or breakthrough, why not? Looking good. Plenty of artillery, uh, plenty of that, so we can increase this. More speed. For more armor. There you go. A lot of reliability. Speed's up. Looking pretty good. Uses a lot of fuel. Uses a lot of army XP. Which does kind of suck, but that's alright. There you go. Start making some chromium stuff. That's just fine, hold. Uh, give it five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. I can count totally. Let's go in. They can probably... No, they can't pierce us, but we can pierce them. That's interesting. Oh, they have air superiority too. Tatrosa. Just trying to build up some big old enemies for us to fight in the future. War measures, propaganda effort. Uh, we don't really need that. Political actions? No. E economic policy? Uh, that wouldn't be bad. Eventually, you know. Working on it, working on it. Becoming a trickster. That's nice. Ooh. Oh, now I dedicate tank engines. That's fine, whatever. There you go. Get back in the battle. And there you go. You actually beat up a tank division. Good job, guys. So this is looking pretty bad. We have no supply. Things are looking so good. 
and after that, the Kaisari of Elenia. Elenia. Despite being this purely diplomatic unification, many deer are still weary of changing rule. But Karen Thorax is the rival Kaiserai of Elenia. We can both reassert our official claim uh, to the throne and reassure the deer that we mean nothing but good. Of course. Of course, absolutely. Light tanks, uh, that's all ahead of time. Yeah, research speed, yeah, why not? There you go. Get in there because we're going to try to thrust our way this way because we like to thrust. Good. I'll grab that one too. Can you do anything here, maybe? Can you do that? Follow better. Nice. Okay, looking okay here. Can you go this way? You know what? Save one. Save one. Save none. Cool. And brush efficiency gain. I like ground attack. Do you see it goes down? I right, just more ground attack though? Yeah. Just max it out. It's nice. You making more ships? No, we're not. Because we have no steel. So these guys are about to lose. Stalingrad has won the war for the most part. Keep going. New Krona, huh? See what you can do going around him. Armor, it's not bad. Just going there anyways. We lost the battle, but they left, they left anyway, so who cares? And do this, there you go, very nice, very nice. Armor, defense, breakthrough. Just max out that armor. How have they not lost yet? It's kind of, uh, kind of insane, but hey! <laughs> Isn't this kind of beautiful? We got them anyways. Oh, fantastic. I don't even want to bother with these guys. Maybe except for the Mountaineers. Mountaineers might be interesting to use, but we have Jaegers, so I'm not even concerning, concerned about that. There you go. Welcome to the line. Oh, we don't even get them as generals. Look at that. That's different. Anti tank. Trains. Huh. Oh, we do have that mountain here, so I guess, yeah. We could do that if we really wanted to, but we don't need to. Occupy territories, local police force, local autonomy, and actually, with that, we're going to do this real quick first. Let's see. Well, maybe not real quick, but fast enough. There you go. What am I thinking of? Ah, divisions. So, it's not bad. Mountaineer divisions, elite, are interesting. These guys, infantry template one. Oh, these guys aren't terrible. 30 combo. Eh. I'm not sure what a good combo with these for our guys. That's not bad. That's easier to use than what we've got currently. Eh, but I guess we do have infiltrator companies too. Hmm. Light temp tank templates. Eh. I'm not going to throw anti-air onto that for that. these guys. No. Nah, we're good. These guys could be a good military police division. Yeah. It's whatever. MPs, yes please. Honestly, you can even use... Uh, Infiltrators for suppression. Suppression bonus plus 20%. It's not bad. There you go. Use that. Hammer and fist them. Nice. Because we don't have enough guns, we did get the stockpile. And we don't have cores yet, so which kind of sucks for us, but still. Okay, you guys are all going to get killed off here, so we're done with you. Nice job, guys. You did a good job. Having said, Griffonian Empire, Griffonian Republic. New houses are good. Come over here. We're going to grab this next. We are out of manpower, pony power. Then what? Alinean generals. Oh, then we get the generals. It takes 70 days. My god. New capital. Alinean advisors. New capital. This is a union under capital staying and changing territory has brought some alarm. I have proposed that we should move it to a more central location to help us sort of government's presence and make sure no one suspects us of a biased policies. And I probably want. Heartland Administration. We must integrate the Heartland Region into a bureaucracy. Eventually, we want Service Administration. We must integrate the Service Region into a bureaucracy. And then the Sakara, Sakara Administration. We must integrate the Sakara Region into our bureaucracy, as well as, uh, what is this? The Vava Front Administration. We must integrate the Vava Front Region into a bureaucracy. And then Northern Administration. 
We must integrate the far north and region into our bureaucracy. And those are all good to do. Renew militarism as well. And emergency war plans with new threats on the horizon. A threat to harmony and to the freedom of everyone on this continent. We need to develop plans to defeat them and restore harmony. And then we're probably going to need to uh, skewer the monster. It's time to strike the horrible Lunar Empire and bring an end to Nightmare, uh, Nightmare Moon's rule. Once for all, Equestria must be freed. Hyzorai Thorax. In spite of the years of differences of the two nations, Queen Velvet has decided to unite the changelings and dears one nation under the diarchal rule of the married duo. As of this moment forward, King Thorax is now Kaiserai Thorax, and both the Lenia and the Changing Lands are the Lenium Changing Commonwealth. So we can have keep with our guy, Kaiserai Thorax Jelzek, or Kaiserina Velvet Jelzek, which I do like this one. I want to try this one out, but we're going to keep with this our main guy here just because, uh, oh, look at that. Uh, oh, chat, a flag change too. I wonder if this would do anything else to help him out, but I guess not, you know. Oh. Abyssinian Crisis. Sounds pretty normal. This morning at 4 o'clock on July 4th, 10-11, Kaiser Thorax Jelzek was crowned ruler of the Olenian Changing Commonwealth. At the opening of today's thousand-year-old riot, the al Yargurgi presented Kaiser Thorax Jelzek the, to the citizens of both countries as their undoubted ruler. That is by holy right. Three hours later, they went forth from the coronation event amidst a great rejoicing, a crowned and consecrated monarch. No such delight. Oh, uh, has been hailed a sovereign's coronation before. Interesting. Oh, so they won. They took most of the territory, but not all the territory. Well, that's really weird. Why would they do that? Oh. And they're fighting the Arctic Empire. Well, good luck with that, guys. Um, so we're still trying to get a lot of things done here and whatnot. So, <clears throat> in the meantime, what do we got here? I like the heavy attacks. I like them heavy. Um, uh, motorized is fine and all. That's whatever. You know, it is what it is. Uh, we got uh, the Navy here, too. So, I'm going to take all the submarines out. There we go. You are now under new rule. This bar, very nice. Um, sea Wolf, Silent Hunter, yes. Torpedo cooldown, just chuck as many freaking torpedoes as you possibly can. This bar, ooh. There goes Pingland, Democratic Republic of Pingland. Megan Stallion, big old and strong. Uh, could become a lone wolf, but we're good. That's this, defense, armor, sure, why not? You, on the other hand, ooh, another tank division, nice. Uh, there you go. Military fleets is good. Logistics, so oh, we can wait on that. Maybe maintenance companies for our tanks. Yeah, sounds like a smart idea, probably. And then what? This is coming along very nicely. Military training. Yeah, we can do that. Why not? Radio propaganda, we're good. Still no manpower. As we still try to get the new capital. Confederation polar bears declared war on the... Oh. Well, that's a big old mistake. But we can help them out no matter what, right? Republicanism. How many volunteers do we get? Four. Um, do we want to send the tanks in? Artillery would probably be better, but we're going to do it anyways, so. I do want to send you, so you three will stay, you four stay. There you go. Of course, I do want to go to, like I said, I do want to go to where these guys, but they do have planes, and we really don't have any planes, or manpower at all, at, for the fact, uh, right now. I forgot we went down trade interdiction as well. There you go, grab that too. And so we'll probably need to go to limited conscription at the very least. Capital of the Commonwealth. While the unification of Olenian changing lands is the Olenian changeling commonwealth, a decision has to be made regarding the capital. Well, continuing to rule from Vesopolis is the easiest to justify. Considering it's where the changeling ruled from the, for nearly all time, arguments had to be made for moving the capital to the Olenian capital in Hortland. Alternatively, arguments. Have been made for moving the capital uh, to two of the Alenian and Changeling's biggest cities, Veverfront and Vrax. While not as significant historically as the two current capitals, moving it to one of the other two may bring a sense of unity to the newly formed Commonwealth. Visopolis. I like this one. But Heartland is it's it's way too far, and it's a coastal city, which I don't like. Um, Veverfront is also a coastal city, which I don't like, so Vrax would be fine. Let's go to Vrax. That's different. And we'll go that one next. Just so we start making some more cores and whatnot. And what do we got here? Polar bears, you have been up way more than you probably can chew. And we'll just whatever, you know. It is what it is. And thank you. Can you do anything here? Can you do stuff like this, maybe? Where are you at? Ah, you're all the way over there. It's fine. Do that too. Uh, anything we care about there? No, not really. We we're remobilizing, which is fantastic. Getting some of these guys done, getting some of those guys done. How many medium panthers? Oh, we're out of guns. Um, because we, oh, we're out of artillery because they made our guys even bigger. 
38. That's oh, that's his anti-air. Never mind. Anti-air artillery. No one has artillery. Good to know. There you go. All right. Thank you. We'll take whatever we can grab. Honestly. That's all desperate we are for some more arty. You know, we'll take even one. Screw it. We bought everything on the market. Literally bought everything on the market. You're here to help hold. That's all that matters right now. Or maybe pushing two. That could always help, right? Right. As long as you don't lose supply, we're good. We don't get a political power date, god dang it. When you when can you become an experienced diplomat? Come on. Um, Hive to Hortland line. That's not bad for infrastructure. Combined parliaments, that's good. Resource Oh, we definitely need that one. Uh, we require all this stuff. So we're gonna keep going through all this stuff and start getting ready to go to war with these guys, maybe. Empty air would be good. You know what, we're gonna increase it by three here. And we need way more art party. So but this is also good because now we can actually deploy some extra planes if we have them. So train them first. Do that. Uh, mobile infantry. Let's creek. We are using quite a bit of infantry, so we're going to do that one probably. And we're going to come over here. We don't have enough armor XP yet. God dang it. Hands are right, whatever. Are they attacking us? Or are they attacking them? Okay, well, can you actually win here? You might be able to. Side channel attacks are not bad. Maintenance companies are good. We're going to come back over here, though, and grab this. Thank you. Infantry. It's only 24 combo, which is fine. And we're going to set and on some anti-air. Because we're going to need that. Gives us a slight bit of piercing, too. Which is good. Um, I can't justify attacking there. I just can't. Agent captured. Not ideal. Oh, fine, 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 fine. Still building up good stuff here? Yes, we are. We're in Empire. Operations. Good. Need more already though. Just max it out there. Um, Commerce cru cruisers, not bad. Get some rapid fire. No, not rapid fire. Well, medium light batteries. Anti air is okay. You know what? We're gonna go over here first. Radar, yes. Sonar, yes. Secondary batteries. Cruiser armor. It's nice. Uh, get some torpedoes. That's fine. Medium batteries. We have more than enough naval XP. It's fine. Ooh. Level three is good. Anti sub stuff and we don't. I don't use reuse mines. More anti air perhaps. Is this an optimal way of using these guys? God no. It's really actually really really not. Optimally, you want like like the lightest light cruisers possible, I think, and then like light guns. That's it. That's a broken cheesy way to do it. But I don't want to be broken and cheesy. I go three. Medium tanks looking pretty good. Can we trade one out now? Panzer divisions, honestly. 18 combat width. We might just throw on another group here. We have 20, which is not bad. I might go 25 combat width, maybe. Change it to armored uh, armored tanks, maybe. Where are we at? We're over here. You're trying, but I'm not sure if it's really worth doing. Could you actually do this? We got your ah, ship stuff. That's fine. <clears throat> Civilian economy, it's fine. I just don't want supply issues, you know? Can you help them out, maybe? Maybe, maybe not. Stability's good, though. Hey, yeah, I can't actually do that. Look at that. Hold. You go here. Oh, they're posting the defense. Oh, that's ra pretty radical. Northern the administration's good. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do renew militarism because I won't get more division organization. That's just super important to get. You know what? You go here. That's not gonna make a huge difference, but you know, opens up the combo with maybe slightly more. And here, armor special. You know what? Armor special. I'm okay with that too. What else we got? Ooh, that's nice. There we go. And what was I thinking of? Something else I wanted us to do too. Infantry would be good. Army grouping's not bad either. Get right here. And we're split up and... Ah, oh, we were so close. God dang it. 
that sucks. Get, get back here. I was thinking of something else. The Krovic incident? There you go. Nice. All that matters is right here, then. Defensives. That's fine. Spread them around a little bit. Are we still getting weekly 500 map pony power? No, we're not. Dang it. That sucks. Improved small airframes are very good, though. Before we do anything else, we're going to get some new engines, though. It's not good enough. Oh, we need more than this. We need way more than that. Basic, basic, basic. They're all basics. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Nice. Details here. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. And you know what? We're working on subs. We might as well use the best subs, right? Exactly. Exactly. Honestly, none of these really matter. I guess we can go military theorist. Doesn't really matter at all, really. There we go. I have fun with it. Like we normally say. Is this? Ah, it is part of the supply line. There you go. Nice. Good job, guys. I don't think you're still going to win, but, you know, it's alright. Welcome back. Philadelphia, yes. Private Republic, you can go here. They have airspeed. Oh, I want to throw air support here. Well, but they don't have airplanes here, or air bases. There you go. Keep spreading out. Blight number theory, nice. Uh, that seems okay, but, you know, nuclear technology seems pretty reasonable. More radar, yes. And what else? Armor, production costs, way more armor. Oh, I love the armor. I love them thick. Yeah, let them attack us, why not? So now, once we get this, we can do some defenses, revitalize the mi military, soft attack, continue patterns of modernization, support equipment, robot tests, robot tests, rocket tests, jet engines, jet fighters. We get all sorts of blueprints. So then these end up all being blueprints, which is why I've not done very much here. Ooh! Royal Infantry Academy get more population, which is actually very helpful for us. They dedicated motorized production, which is okay. It's not worth it, though. Because once you have a big enough military, it's not worth it either. Royal Infantry Academy, honestly, it doesn't fit what we're doing since we are, like, motorized and whatnot. But that makes the most sense out of everything here. I like the 5%, but it's only 5%. These are just all blueprints. So we're going to keep going, going down this way. Hey, look at that. Nice. Fall Lake City. Whoa to the vanquished. Nice job. Four. Just kind of hanging out here, huh? It's not a bad idea. Sometimes you, all you have to do and can do is hang out. Nice job, guys. I'm going to go in. Beat the crap out of them. So we're still missing a crap ton of artillery. Can we buy any more? There you go. Nope. Uh, that's anti-air. Every little bit helps. It's only cost one, too, so it doesn't take too long. Pre and uh, you know, pre-industrial. Uh, I don't know about that, man. Stalingrad is really not doing as well as I hope they would. Armor's doing all right. That would be pretty good too. Open oh, grab this person next. The blink is nice. So after the service, and then we're gonna go to, yeah, we're gonna do emergency war plans. I want to go to war, like us officially go to war. That's just more fun. I wonder if we can hold out against these guys. Oh, hello. Now yeah, the time go on. It's fine. Oh god, dang it. Administration, you know, ah, oh, screw it, we'll just get one more then. It's fine. Hey, right, another tank division. Oh, are you part of them? No, you're not. Which is good. There you go. Mm. 
Of course, we have no Jaegers either, which is kind of probably a mistake. If I threw these guys on, would it hurt us more? It would hurt our speed. It would hurt our speed. It's not ideal. Oh, just giant Jaeger divisions. Uh, field, field hospitals, infiltrators, yeah. There you go. There. For funsies, you can make one too. Water injected, seems pretty nice. Cannons, heavy bomb locks. Never really used those before. Uh, your ship's got that's fine. Basics, cool. Honestly, we're not gonna have enough time to make carriers like that, so. There we go. Uh, armor plates, armor plates, and so fuel, four heavy machine guns, and aircraft cannons. It's fine, there we go. The cast, same idea. Enough XP for this armor plates, armor plates, so fueling, cast. I don't ever know which one to choose. This one seems pretty good. Bomb locks. I always use small bomb because it doesn't hurt our speed. It does hurt our weight though. I don't like that. It does hurt agility. They all hurt our speed. I don't like more weight though. We really don't want more weight. It's fine. There you go. Let's see what you can do about that. Uh, you might want this. This will give you more supply through here. That would be ideal. Yes, please. Uh, that would feel a little better, hopefully. And nope. Over here. Yep. Ooh, you lost. That's not good. Oh, you're not even connected. You're not even connected anywhere here. Oh, now you're connected. So now I feel a little better, huh? Look how much faster you can move in once you have supplies. Go figure. There you go. The Ronk the Enchir up Terra. That's fine. You know, we have a slight navy. It's not great, but you know, whatever. Can you guys just kind of do this? Maybe? And then head there, maybe? Go there, and then maybe go there. I want to kind of avoid the mounts as much as possible. Go there. Really go around them. Drastically go around them. Is this good for our tanks? God, no, but whatever. Subs too, but still. Artillery looking at 1300. Not bad. Could be better. Could be worse. Any more we could buy? Oh, oh yeah, we can. There we go. Uh, no, we'll go with that. Bad. And you're in, nice. Can you do anything there? I should help them out quite a bit. Better subs, yes please. Better engines, nice. Torpedo data one, torpedoes. Oh, we don't have enough. Anything level two we're getting rid of. It's not worth using. Keep making more naval XP and stuff, why not? Nice. Emergency war plans and uh, screw the monster. Should be very good. Alright. See what we can do. It is in the mountains and hills and whatnot, which is bad, but whatever. Anything else around here? Recovery rate. Definitely recovery rate. Yes, yeah, so I'm glad it's doing much worse than I thought they would. They did struggle with Nova Grafonia, but still. Doesn't make any sense. 
uh, lum uh, Lycida lumber industry? Our main source of wood comes from Lycida. Expanding and developing in the region will allow us to better take care of and harvest the forests. Uh, Svart Forest Steel Production. Svart Forest containing planting of room, coal, and iron, and such is suitable for the new steel mills to be created there, both for export and manufacturing. Arctic oil, eventually. It's been known for a long time that there's oil under the frozen tundra up north. With the right equipment, it should be easier to tap into the resource. Invest in the Tainahol mines? The Tainahol mine shafts were closed down after serious concerns from the Olenia about the safety of deer and changelings both working in the same mines. Excuse me, both working in the same mines. Those concerns cannot be alleviated with a clear conscience. A modernized hives. Now the changing nation as a whole has been brought up to scratch for production needs, needs changings to staff them. Plus, with more changelings brings more friends for everybody. Yeah, not bad. Ooh, joint resource development. The combined industry both the nations allows for each of our each to cover each other's weaknesses as well as help promote further growth. Combine parliaments. Combine the parliaments of both the Lenny and the Changelings will allow both the Deer and Changelings to have a say in the political running of the Commonwealth and keep all our people happy. Hive de Heartland Lime. An effort. Help unify the two nations. A railroad running from the Vesipolis to Heartland has been proposed allowing for easier travel. Sounds like a good idea. Snorkels, yes please. You guys, yes please. Yes, yes, yes please. Sack of Scott. Oh. That sucks. Alenian advisors, many of the Alenians formerly employed in the government, have expressed their displeasure at no longer having a job. Luckily enough, we have a few vacancies, and many of them have, may prove useful to us and Alenian generals. Alenians are experts in traveling the, traversing the cold lands of their home as well as in coastal invasions. By integrating this into our army, we can benefit greatly. Yeah, that seems. Oh. The Assaultaminen plan. Fall of Cloudberry, huh? Oh, another research slot. Oh, I like that. But we got other stuff here we got to do. What else we got here? Uh, we definitely need a better anti-air. Yeah, that's a good, ideal thing to have. Anti-air. There we go. More divisions. Research. Looking pretty good. This guy's factory is nice. What are we building up? Not much. All right, then. You guys do that. Uh, we got a lot of things to build throughout here, don't we? And we can screw the monster. I want to rush for that um, research slot, though. Because right now, research-wise, we're still lacking steel and some rubber, which is not ideal, but still. All right, so with that in mind, you guys are going to get radar and uh, torpedoes. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Oh. Battleship is out of date, huh? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, radar battleships. Heavy batteries. Anti-air. Fire controls. Radar threes. Yes, please. Secondary batteries. Battleship armor one. Good god, no. Battleship armor three. Um, we'll go with the last one of these and get some anti-air and get some more aircraft facilities. It doesn't hurt us too badly in terms of speed, because everything else kind of does. Ooh. I really don't want to go below 21. 29, there you go. There you go. Not bad. Just need a crap ton more steel. What do we got here? Anything else? No? Alright. So we could go to war now. Ooh. We are getting attacked. Would we be able to do okay against these guys? At the very least, hold out. Empire Strikes Back, huh? Because we don't really have a good Air Force yet. It is what it is. I've neglected them, I know. I'm a terrible father. There you go. What else? Crystal's class. It's not bad. Well, we can see what happens. There we go on the front line here. Maybe. Get you guys up here as fast as possible. Not bad, not bad. You guys do that. Go and repair real quick, and you guys do that too. Plenty of time for that. 10 12. We're fine here. 10 13. Okay. Maintenance. Ooh, I forgot there were maintenance puppies on our guys. Tanks. Sure. Supply trucks, reinforcements, garrisons looking pretty good. Alright, well, we can try. Let's save the game real quick. Ooh, Stalingrad did invade up there, which is fine, whatever. We don't care. Oh, they're doing a border war, huh? So if we go to war with these guys... Can we do anything here yet? The Lunar Empire has been called in against us. Um, 
Our guys are being recalled. They're shifting their divisions around. I want to see what happens first. So they don't start attacking us, and we'll all start attacking soon. Mm, let's, you know what? We'll do that once. Why not? And of course, they start doing this. Crap. Yes. guys showing back up. 3rd of October, the Empire is fully to crypto, which is good. There you go. Ooh, not ideal. Oh, they actually made it here. Oh, that's not good. Well, that's one way to deal with them, maybe. And... Bing. Bong, boom. Could we try a general attack? If not, you know, it is what it is. Are you still repairing here? And, yeah. In some places, yes, we'll do be we'll do fine. Some other places, uh, not so much. Man, they're landing a lot of guys down there, aren't they? Oh boy. That's a lot of enemy ships, isn't it? But we're doing okay in some places. Over here, though, we definitely want to go to limited exports, help our supplies out. Oh, now we have more than enough steel. That sucks. Ah, but the ships are down there. That's good. Hope they're learning a lot. Lots of, lots of, lot of convoys. Nice. 17 convoys. Tons of convoys. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Aeros wants to help out. Good as they should. Nice. You know what? You can do that, too, if you need to. As long as they can't find us, that's the most important thing. On the main front, we're doing... Oh, my God. Look at that naval XP. We're doing... Pushing their first combined parliaments, nice. Kaiser on his plans, not bad, not a bad idea. Can do anything here? Maybe here, perhaps. Maybe here, perhaps. Because we need you down there now. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Lost three destroyers, not ideal. I'm going to tell you all just go home and repair. Just just go and repair. We stopped them from infiltrating and whatnot. But this is not ideal. Yeah, they're here. We'll help push through here too. But uh, we don't need any of this stuff yet. Hey, more organization is always good. I see losses. 61,000 versus... Oh, wow. We've got up quite a few of them. Probably mostly through destroying convoys, perhaps. Take a look, see. Since we do have spies here, don't we? Lunarist capitalism. Hmm. I'm not seeing anything here, and not in the future, that would really give them too many benefits. Really, they don't have any military benefits. They've got quite an army, quite a few divisions, stockpile. Oh. Okay then. Um, manpower is not bad. They have way more than us, so we probably need to save some political power to make sure we raise our divisions more and more and more and more. Because um, they have way more, but we have more equipment than them, for now. Well, at least we did. And this is not ideal for us down here, but we're suffering, they're suffering, everyone's suffering here. Oh, god dang it, are you kidding me? Here. Let them land, and... Go here. Interesting. Led by you. Uh. Okay. Of course, the more divisions I pull away from there, the more divisions we can fight, put on the front and kill them off that way. So, 
And they're already out of guns. And we're just out of manpower. That's all we're out of. Oh god, they all landed down here. That's not good. Blast explosives. Very nice. Come on. I can't believe you gave him a freaking port. The front's doing okay. How many divisions do they have in total? They have a, quite a few. We only have 95, which is not ideal, but it is what it is. We're actually doing alright. If we can isolate these guys and make sure that they have no more supply through here, we'll definitely get these guys down. Yeah, there you go. That's the way we want to do it. Yeah. What are we doing for right now? Oh, this one's still. 30 more days left. It's fine, whatever. Right here, it's good. Good. Some more convoys go by by. Good. Ooh, we're going to here. Yes, please. Um, Fuel is actually okay. Let me grab this because we are probably losing quite a few guys. Which is not ideal. The sooner we can take these guys out, the better. And we can spread out this way. Oh, it's not going to happen, is it? Oh my god, they just keep spreading like cancer. So, we're going to keep grinding this way, probably. That's all we really can do. Oh. I need you guys to act and just go. You guys need a more attack here. That's fine. Maintenance. It's a little ahead of time, that's fine. Come on, you're really close. You are so close, it's not funny. There's only two divisions here. You can do it. Keep them down and around. Bro, seriously. What are you doing? Get an actual battleship in there, finally. Any progress and efforts? Yes. Can you actually do anything there, maybe? Go here. Go here. That'll be fine. Is there? Nope. Right. Anything here? Winner expert? Oh, well, let's be charismatic. Because on the front, we're still doing okay. We lost 163,000. We killed off half a million. Things are so far not looking super good, but whatever. We didn't make him a sickman down here, though. Good. Okay, so now things are looking up just a little bit better. Looking a tiny bit better here. Got a couple divisions here that are doing alright. You guys did a great job, and you're going to push down through here. What else? Stop losing ships. God dang it, come on. Ships are expensive. Oh, we have another thing here. I don't want to spend another thing here. Far, four. It's not bad. And the uh, Velvet's Astuta Menin plan. And uh, Kaiserina's Velvet Academy. Our dear Kaiserina Velvet has yet another idea. Even before the changeling support was announced, Velvet dreamed of what she would do if she ruled. Such one idea was to promote higher learning within Olenians by construction of a new Velvet Queen Academy. With a new commonwealth, we can help make that a reality. The Kaiserina's plan. Kaiserina Velvet's plan for the settlement of northern Olenia is in full swing, and is a great success, providing living space for many deer and changelings. The vast empty Olenian lands can now finally be used to their full potential. Fantastic. But we're going to end it there. I'm going to continue grinding through this just a little bit more. And see if we can stop all the influx of Terrans and uh, Lunar Empire here. Because they're out of guns like we said before. But we don't have a lot of supply. And we're running out of uh, manpower. And trucks, I guess, too. But hey, if you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow as we're going to continue struggling through the Lunar Empire. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.